I look at a river now and I think, these things are holding some secrets. I've seen others get them to reveal their magic by using tools similar to the ones my grandfather left behind. I want to learn. I want to learn firsthand, and I want to make all the necessary mistakes. Because fly fishing looks like a lot of fun. And it turns out, it is. to learn fly fishing, so we set out for a weekend of camping and fishing in the Catskills. We met a local when we were up there, and he, he gave us tons of awesome tips and techniques, but he couldn't guarantee us anything. He told us to just stay right near our campsite, warning us that the other spots weren't going to be as productive. He was right, but our curiosities got the best of us and we had to go explore the waters around us. An early catch misled us into thinking there'd be plenty more but a full day of casting was a welcomed exercise for us. So I hadn't caught anything all day, and as any fisherman will tell you, you tell yourself, one more cast. So four or five casts later, I finally get what I'm looking for. Big tug at the end of the line. Just like that, a brief encounter with something larger than our expectations revived our new obsession. So does this mean we know what we're doing? In order to stay humble, we'll file this one under beginner's luck. But now I'm thinking, what other secrets do these rivers hold? <laughs> <laughs> 